it's important to understand that we're not here to teach about language for language's sake, but the SCH language department helps students become more culturally competent and able to communicate through languages of different cultures around the world. As language coaches, we have a unique opportunity and honestly a responsibility to open up the world outside our immediate surroundings via another language. What we do and why we are here is best summed up in a quote from an alum um, who gets to the core of our department goals. I'm one who believes that the proof is in the pudding, so our students represent us best. We speak language, the language all year. We also get to talk about a variety of topics and issues. In this class, I probably have learned more about the world and have had my eyes open to more current events than in any other class. So our students begin ninth grade either by continuing with their language in Chinese, French, Latin, or Spanish, or beginning a level one course. Um, our students graduation requirement is to successfully complete through level three. Most of our students go on to levels four and many continue to level five. Um, our level one and two classes are untracked and we offer honors courses in levels three and four. Um, in level five we offer both college prep and AP. In upper school, we offer our students the opportunity to communicate with purpose in either Chinese, French, or Spanish in order to express themselves and negotiate meaning in our diverse world. And the goal of our upper school Latin program is to help students become competent readers and translators of Latin by mastering the subtlety of usage in original Latin texts and secondary readings. These readings provide an understanding of the historical and cultural world of the Romans and because their foundational texts are still relevant and important in our world today. So we embed students with our local and international partners. Students participate in everything from scavenger hunts with the Latinx community in South Philly to homestays with both urban and rural families in Senegal. We're not tourists. We're culturally competent and active participants in the communities with whom we collaborate. Um, we've also partnered with our lower school community at SCH by creating digital books and letters to pen pals in other languages. So the bottom line is that we as humans, we crave connections and we really have the greatest job because we provide our students the opportunity to competently and confidently build those relationships and contribute meaningfully with communities at home and around the world in another language. So I'd like to end with a quote from acclaimed author ta Coates. This is from his book, Between the World and Me. Your mother had taken many pictures all through Paris of doors, giant doors, deep blue, ebony, orange, turquoise, and burning red doors. I examined the pictures of these giant doors in our small Harlem apartment. I had never seen anything like them. It had never even occurred to me that such giant doors could exist, could be so common in one part of the world and totally absent in another. And it occurred to me, listening to your mother, that France was not a thought experiment, but an actual place filled with actual people whose traditions were different, whose lives were really different, and whose sense of beauty was different. He continues, seven years after I saw the pictures of those doors, I received my first adult passport. I wish I had come to it sooner. I wish when I was back in that French class, that I had connected the conjugations, verbs, and gendered nouns to something grander. I wish someone had told me what that class really was, a gate to some other blue world. As I said earlier, our students bring out the best in us and represent us best. At the beginning of every school year, I like to read this quote to my students because I know that they will hold me accountable to make sure that together we open up and explore all that's behind those doors.